Hey, what's up everybody? It's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to enable the hidden notification light on the new Nexus 6. So the Nexus 6 has a Moto X-like feature called Active Display that uses the AMOLED screen to display black and white notifications without using much battery at all. But a lot of people have found this feature to be a bit inconsistent, and because it uses your device's accelerometer to show you notifications when you pick it up, it also means that you're very susceptible to accidental pocket dialing. So you can turn the feature off in settings if you don't like it, but that means you don't get any notification indicators at all when your screen is off. But it was recently discovered that the Nexus 6 has a regular LED notification light built right into the top speaker. For whatever reason, Google disabled this feature in the stock ROM for the N6, but if you're rooted you can turn it back on. The only app that's capable of doing this right now though is the paid version of Lightflow. I mean, it's a great app, and it's worth every penny, but I just wanted to give you a heads up that this one will cost you $2.49. So if you're rooted and you can maybe skip buying that cup of coffee tomorrow morning, you really should give this one a try. Now the first thing to do when you launch Lightflow is to head into the main settings. In here, head to device settings and root, and go ahead and tick this box next to root mode, then hit grant on the super user access request. From there, make sure that you also tick this box next to run every command is root, because that'll be needed to activate the hidden LED. Finally, Enable this topmost option called Direct Mode, then press OK on the pop-up and Lightflow will restart. So all the Nexus 6 specific things are all set up now, but Lightflow itself will need a bit more configuration. For starters, go ahead and tap Set Up on this notification access message. This will take you to an Android settings menu, where you should tick the box next to Lightflow, then press OK. After that, go ahead and back out to Lightflow again. Then use the side navigation menu to head to notification settings. And here you can configure the various options for individual apps and their notifications. Stuff like LED color and sounds, which is really the main point of Lightflow to begin with. You can use this plus button to add an app that's not already in this list. But to configure one of the existing apps, tap the three dot menu button and go to settings. Not all of the options are available on the Nexus 6, since it was pretty difficult to even get the LED light working in the first place. So you can't set a flash rate for the LED, but if you swipe over to the light tab, you can change the color for this specific app. But when you have it all set up the way you want it, go ahead and tap the three dot menu button at the top of the screen and pick test. From here, just turn your screen off and wait a second or two, and you'll see your newly enabled LED light. That's awesome, right? And certainly worth a couple of bucks in my opinion. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article at the link in the description below. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.